We're told the graph of y equals 2 to the x is shown below. All right. Which of the following is the graph of y equals 2 to the negative x minus 5? So there's two changes here. Instead of 2 to the x, we have 2 to the negative x. And then we're not leaving that alone. We then subtract 5. So let's take them step by step. So let's first think about what y equals 2 to the negative x will look like. Well, any input we now put into it, x, we're now going to take the negative of it. So if I input a 2, it's like taking the opposite of the 2 and then inputting that into 2 to the x. And so what we're essentially going to do is flip this graph over the y-axis. So if here we have the point 2 comma 4. Over here we're going to have the point negative 2 comma 4. When x is 0, they're going to give us the same value, so they're both going to have the same y-intercept. And so our graph is going to look like, our graph is going to look something like this. They're going to be mirror images flipped around the y-axis. And so it's going to look, it's going to look like that. That is the graph of y is equal to 2 to the negative x. And then we have to worry about the subtracting 5 from it. Well, that's, you're subtracting 5 from your final y value, so that's going to, or you're subtracting 5 to get your y value now, or your y value is going to be 5 lower, is I guess the best way to say it. So this is going to shift the graph down by 5. So instead of having the y intercept there, it's going to be 5 lower. 1, 2, 1, the, each hash mark is 2, so this is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. It's going to be right over there. So shift down by 5. 2, 4, 5. It's going to look like that. And then the asymptote, instead of the asymptote going towards y equals 0, the asymptote is going to be at y is equal to negative 5. So the asymptote is going to be y equals negative 5. So it should look something like, it should look something like, something like, what I'm drawing right now. So something like something like that. So now we can look at which choices. So this, this should be the graph of y equals 2 to the negative x minus 5. So let's see which of these choices depict that. So this first choice actually seems to be spot on. It's exactly what we drew. But we could look at the other ones just in case. Well, this is this looks like what did they do over here? It looks like they, instead of flipping over the y-axis, they, the, they flipped over the x-axis, and then they shifted down. So that's not right. Here, it looks like they got what we got, but then they flipped it over the x-axis. And this looks like they flipped it over the y-axis, but then they shifted, instead of shifting down by 5, it looks like they shifted to the left by 5. So we should feel pretty good, especially because we essentially drew this before even looking at the choice.